Hey, it's Anthony, and today I'm going to show you how to build this amazing metal roof for your HO scale barn. Okay, this is all handmade, uh, and like in my explanation, uh, this metal roof is made out of a piece from your dryer vent replacement fan cover. Okay, and this is all handmade. Uh, I got the blue tape there just to hold it in place for now. Uh, I do have a couple touches to do, but uh, you can see the nail holes and you can see the nice ripple effect that I've put in uh, by hand. So I'll show you how to do that in my next clip. Okay, step one. Uh, you'll go to your local uh, hardware store, Home Depot, Lowe's, what have you. Uh, you'll pick up your dryer vent replacement cover. Comes with a piece of stainless steel and a cover. Uh, so I break this off, and now the blade part I uh, save for another project, but I'll discard that for now. Uh, what I'll be left with is this tubular piece of stainless steel that I'm going to work with. All right, so after I've taken this apart, um, I'll straighten it out, and I'll have a nice piece of stainless steel that I'm going to work with. And just work it in until it obeys. All right, so we'll have a nice flat surface to work with. Now I'm going to ready, I'm going to mark it, and I'm going to cut out my square for one side of the roof. Okay, this is uh, one piece that I've cut out, and I've already worked with it, so I want to show you what I've done. Uh, this is one side of the roof, and then you'll have another side. Uh, so what I've done is I've uh, gone with a straight edge and talked an exacto blade and made grooves in it. So I'd cut it, and then I would flip it, and I would do the other side, and then I'd flip it, and then I'd work my way down uh, eighth of an inch to sixteenth of an inch each row. And I would keep doing that and flip it and cut it and flip it. It's pretty tedious, but you do get a very realistic uh, effect. And the other thing I did was I took a finishing nail, and I took a hammer, and I marked a straight line along the roof, took the finishing nail, and made holes in each ripple. I did two rows to kind of give it like, you know, three sheets of plywood for an HO scale. And that's how I came up with the stainless steel roof look. So hopefully that helps you out. Uh, I will have better videos in the future. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, have fun. Thanks for watching. So there is the almost finished roof. I do uh, have a plan to uh, weather it. It's kind of new looking and I kind of enjoy it. But uh, And I also wanted to show you that this top piece here, okay, is cut out inch and a quarter and then I creased it right down the middle and then I kept working it with my hand until it fitted in. So that's why I've taped it and I'll leave it taped up for, you know, like a week or two until it like holds its shape. And uh, if I like it, I will glue it in place. So that's how you build a stainless steel roof for an HO scale farm barn. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.